Here's the Merklin 60943 high efficiency motor conversion set. This set is used to upgrade Scheiben collector motor Kleiner Bau Art, in other words, small flat commutator motors to 5 pole and to DC. And this is needed when you upgrade your older Merklin locomotives to digital. We're going to look and see what is inside the kit, and then we are going to show you what motor needs to be upgraded with this kit, and then finally how to install it. So let's open up the box first. And inside the box, we will find a little tray with all the parts that are needed to upgrade your old three pole motor to five pole and convert it to DC. And an instruction pamphlet that looks much like IKEA instructions. There's not a whole lot to it, but the upgrade is also fairly straightforward. Inside the package, we're going to first of all find the DC magnet. This is what changes your old motor. Your old motor has an AC magnet. It also has the motor cover, uh, sometimes referred to as brush plate. Then the armature with the five poles. And then the brushes, the two carbon brushes. A little bag with screws, shrink tubing and a copper tab that you mount on one of the screws. And then last but not least, the two chokes that will suppress interference from the motor. Now the armature that will be replaced is this armature. Now you can tell why my fingers are so dirty. It's the carbon from this armature. It's a small flat commentator armature and in my right hand, I have a large flat commutator armature. You can clearly see the difference here. The commutators or the, the brush plates are both the same size, but for the large flat commutator motor, the three poles are much larger than the commutator. On the small flat commutator motor on the bottom, the armature is about as big or only slightly larger than the commutator. You see three copper plates because it is a three pole motor and the brushes push against those copper plates and that is why you see the grooves and you also see the carbon build up on the corners of these grooves. We grab the truck that needs to be upgraded. The old motor has already been taken out the old armature and magnet, I should say. And here we simply put the new magnet in place, make sure it seats well. Then we grab the armature, put the armature in place, just like the IKEA instructions. And then finally we put the brush plate on top of it. First I gotta make sure everything seats well and then I grab the brush plate. Make sure again there's no gaps and everything is seating and you could see me actually also test the wheels to make sure that everything is properly in place. Then you open up the bag with the little screws. You get the two screws and the little solder point, that little brass piece and you can for now put back the two pieces of shrink tubing. Bottom screw goes on the bottom left and then I add the copper tab or the brass tab to the top screw and it is used to solder your ground wire to when you install the decoder. And there you go. Tighten the screws, try to arrange that brass plate. And 
and then you can give it a final test and make sure that the wheels still move fairly freely. All that's left to do now is to install the two carbon brushes and your five pole motor upgrade is complete. Thanks for watching. See you next time.